Hello, everyone. Welcome to Pace Studio on the Road. We are live right now with Leftover Salmon at Dell Fest in Cumberland, Maryland. It's wonderful to see you guys, man. Thanks Woo! for doing this. Yeah. Thank you guys for bowling out with Dell, man. Yeah, yeah, man. This uh, the weekend is off to an auspicious start. We had Dell in here just about an hour ago. Now you guys are here, and it's just a tremendous lineup. Yeah, so I can't wait to get underway, man. What do you guys feel like playing first today? Man, we're gonna celebrate these brand new good old days we're living in, man. Yes, sir. One, two, three. <laughs> I can find my satisfaction in the faces of your good friends all around. These are the brand new good old days. I used to was a stuck back there in yesterday. It's never more now than it is today. These are the brand new everything about the sentiment of that song i mean it's tempting to look back to the 1960s and the 1970s and say dude the fillmore the fillmore east like, well, how cool was that and that was cool but this is cool man there's a dude running around in the mud over there there's you guys playing music i mean it's a it's a nice day man i'm feeling as the festival soon as spirit they open the gates the dude's in the mud pit man I, that's, that's what we're pledging at here <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, so I got, uh, I heard a little bit just before we went live, I heard about a uh, recent, uh, recent Nashville recording session with some of our favorite names of Billy Strings involved, Oliver Wood involved. Can you talk a little bit about how that session went and when we can potentially expect uh, to, to see new music, hear new music out in the world? It was a blast. Uh, we went into Compass Studios uh, there in downtown Nashville and uh, we were uh, privileged and lucky enough to have Billy Strings come in and do a couple tracks with us and also Oliver Wood came in we did a really fun track with him and we had Daryl Anger come in and play fiddle on a couple things and uh, um, we were originally gonna make um, usual original record you know we all get together write songs and make a record and and uh, we weren't quite ready for that uh, Vince was far more prepared than the rest of us he was ready for uh, probably have enough songs for the whole record but the rest was like well um, so our bass player Greg had this idea why don't we just do covers of you know some of our favorite bluegrass influences and uh, Jay got to sing a tune that his dad sang uh, John Starling in the seldom seen mm -hmm. which came out great and uh, we just really kind of tipped our hat to our influences and made mostly a bluegrass acoustic record and I, I think it came out great it was really fun 
Cool, cool. Well, I'm glad that you guys got to have that experience, and um, I'm really glad that we're here getting to hear songs from Brand New Good Old Days, because I think this is maybe the third time, maybe the fourth time. We've, we've done these studio sessions before, and yeah. obviously missed out on getting to do one of these with you guys in 2021, because everything's so weird, so what here we are. What happened that year? <laughs> <laughs> what happened? <laughs> Something happened. Yeah, I, I don't remember. Yeah, a year around yeah. here somewhere, right? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> And here we are in this uh, yeah. chicken coop on top of a grandstand. So. <laughs> yeah. Um, thank you guys for being here. What do you feel like doing second today? I was fixing bluegrass with an old timey left hand. Yeah, old timey you know? tune I wrote uh, way back in the 80s about a little town west of Boulder called Gold Hill. Uh, which, incidentally, uh, Andy and I are going to do the 60th anniversary of the Gold Hill Inn coming up next month. Um, so, uh, yeah, this is the tune I wrote when I was living there. Vince and I lived in the same house there for a little while. Center of town. If you ever get a chance, check out Gold Hill. Go to the Gold Hill Inn, eat some good food, and hang out with some good folks. But uh, anyway, here's a tune about that. Here we go. Want to get in here a little more? I think they'll hear the banjo from here. Just yeah. <laughs> <laughs> One, two, three. So in addition to this session that we're doing right now, you've got a late night set here at Dell Fest tonight. There's a main stage set uh, tomorrow night and uh, a lot of excitement this entire weekend. You talk about what's coming up in your very near future, this and other uh, other festivals included. John Hartford Festival is up, up next. Um, <laughs> and John Hartford, of course, is, is uh, near and dear to all of our hearts. Uh, I think the most amazing writer of the last millennium. And uh, this festival in his honor there up in uh, Indiana. We're real psyched about that. 
Um, summer uh, camp after this. Summer camp uh, this weekend, and then up into Fest. Harmony Park, up into the Revival. We're doing the Ramble Fest up in uh, Baltimore. We're doing a uh, yeah, festival, so, festival, so, festival so, summer. So, you know, a uh, lot of fun. Good. Yeah. Are you guys at High Sierra this year by any chance? I probably should have looked at the lineup before I asked. No, that. High Sierra. We okay. will be out at the hog farm, though, at the, for Kate Wolf. Yeah, cool. We will be out at High Sierra, so we'll miss you there, but hopefully we'll right. keep on crossing paths. We're having a festival summer as well, so. Uh, yes, indeed. Yes, yes, yes. It's time to get back to festival yes. summers, yeah. I'll tell you that. That's right. Well, um, I am starting to melt, and I think we're all starting to melt with the absence of AC. Yeah, uh, if we dive straight into the third song, what do you guys want to do last time? Right, I one about riding on the L&N, an old railroad train. Keeping that railroad theme going here. Right. One, two, one, two, three. Thank you very much, guys. Thank you. It's been a total pleasure. Uh, cheers to you. Let's go turn on the AC and go splash around in the mud. Woo! Always uh, <laughs> thankful for Pace for uh, getting us in people's ears and eyes. How about that? Absolutely. Yes, indeed. Oh, thank you, guys. All right. Wonderful Delfest weekend to us all, and uh, we'll see you, see you next time. Festival! Right. <laughs>